What's up, guys? TJ Smooth back with another video. Man. Right now, man. Getting ready. Do my thug thizzle, man. So, what I was thinking is that this concert coming up. I don't know if I'm going to. My wife wants me to go. My cousins want to go. My wife is supposed to be going to, or she's supposed to be going, you know, celebrate the holidays and stuff like that. Um, I got outfit all that. I just gotta get my money up, and even with the uh, sneaker collection account, my sneaker account, um. I was gonna start all over, but I'm like, nah, let's just get through it, finish it, push it, it don't matter. You get what I'm saying? And do it like that, so I'm gonna need to find some white and blue J's. I want the white and blue 12s. Like the cherry 12s. But the white and blue 12s or something like that, that'll be hot. That'll be real high if I get some white and blue twelves. And I ain't seen nothing in a minute neither. <laughs> what up, what up, how you doing for that? Alright. I get the white and blue twelves. Right now I get the um, Yankee jacket that we seen and so Take that out the clothing front. If you know what I'm saying? Do it like that. And then I'm going to have to think about getting a white hoodie or a blue hoodie. A blue hoodie be more gangster, but the white hoodie be more crispy with the blue Yankees hat. And I ain't see a blue Yankees hat. And man, you a blue Yankees fit it. What up? All right, I right, give me something a little bit. Cool. No, let me stop. <laughs> I'm telling you, I love that store. So, low. Yeah, they be at. Uh, Alright. So, the kids, they young and stuff. So, like, they be having stuff on low. They don't tell you, like, it's real. I got, I got one that's real. Word. And really do. Cause they, they be buying stuff and reselling stuff. Cause they a store. That's what they do. But yeah, man. Yeah, can you see because it's dark? So show you how far along I came with the pantry so far. Now I got to throw stuff out. Like all the baby stuff that I was going to sell. Only thing is, I would if I could clean it up. But I don't think some of it can't get cleaned up because it was in that corner. And the chemicals got on it and stuff. Faded it and stuff like that. <laughs> and when I say clean chemicals, I'm talking about like cleaning chemicals, like bleach and stuff. But it'll fall over and stuff like that. But I'm starting to organize it. Start to put stuff away. And things like that. And I got idea for a video that I'm gonna do. But we'll figure it out, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? I figure out how I'm gonna set it up though. Cause this video gonna be hilarious. Show you all that, and then I'll show you that. I'll get ready to throw stuff out. Maybe I promise you anything. Cause when I get back to y'all, ain't no telling. I'll probably get some baby cereal too. They ain't had none, but we'll see. What's happening? 
Alright, I'm back. Hey, this is stuff that was in there. In the pantry, stacked up. A whole bunch of baby car seat bottoms and baby stuff and toys and stuff. So, this light, this is what I got that was working and then stopped working. So it snapped. It's a big ass ring light. It's over here in this corner. This, I got to so far. So, I'll pick up all the rest of the stuff. Declutter this. Bring this Christmas stuff out. This is a backyard Christmas stuff and movies. And some cups and stuff. You see where it says fragile? That's our cups and stuff. You know, a lot of stuff is in boxes. So, we keep trying to move. So, that's what I do. Pull all this stuff out. And then, I go back to straighten it up. You see stuff in here. Hold on, baby. We got stuff in here. Our products and stuff stacked up. You know. And she keeps buying the same stuff over and over again. She never come back here to get it. Look, I had to order it. Mad stuff. Got a cold mask. Tissue. All types of stuff. I'm put the rest of this stuff that's over here. See, this is my jacket. Let's see, look. Stay clean. Hand sanitizer, all that stuff. We throw all that stuff down there. Alright. I'll be back. Okay, so right now, we got a dress. Got a little fit on, you know. And what I'm really trying to do is wash these clothes. That's one. Got all them bags of clothes right there. Got more bags of clothes right here. I got just bagging up and stuff like that. Get over there. But I gotta try to figure out a ride. That I can't take all this in over a lift. I gotta actually have somebody take me. So, so right now, we just about to run across the street real quick for a minute. See what's going on. Um, she's trying to get me earlier. I'll try to call her back. And she gonna answer her phone. And I gotta get take all this stuff outside. Take them cans across the street. So that's basically what I'm about to do. I might take that across the street. I don't know yet. We'll see. My wife keeps knocking this stuff up. But uh, at least we'll try to get out her way. But they got cups of milk out here, so. I don't know how keeping our stuff over there. They're like really out of the way. Oh, my mom called now. I'll be right back. So, supposedly she the lost the stuff. My grandmother lost keys to the car. <laughs> Can't find check, but. I think somebody messing with stuff. Wasn't nobody even here at the time. Well, ain't nobody been here for me. Uh, I've been too busy over there trying to get that straightened up. You know, I do got stuff to do over here. You know, I got cut grass and stuff. I said, I've been trying to get that house cleared out. <laughs> and then I got to come over here and clear this house out. But getting rid of this refrigerator right here. Somebody broke the picking it up. You know what I'm saying? Because this one right here, the um, PC board keep going out. And that's $200 for a whole board. And ain't nobody spending no $200 for a board. Just for it to break down again. It kept breaking down. And we keep buying parts for it. And like, it's like, it's time to get rid of it. So, right now, I feel like I got a little decent thin on. But, go ahead and take some pics. Real quick. This outfit on. Well, I got a little nice little outfit on. They trying to get me to do some work. Want me to take the um stove out or stuff? Stove right there on the back porch. All the time, so they trying to get me dirty. You know? I'm trying to be fly. You see, look, they, they always be trying to ruin your flyness, you know? Draped up, draped out. Go with your aces on. Go with your sweatsuit, you know what I'm saying? No. <laughs> Ha, ha, ha.
Gucci down to the drawers, no socks. Gucci white tee. No. <laughs> but anyway, guys, let me um take these flicks real quick, and I'll be right back. Yo, my cousin just said the group chat, and he was like, Nate, he was like, he just wanted tickets to Drake on the radio. I'm like, what? When is this a Drake concert? I didn't even hear of a Drake concert, so I'm about to find out these details, bro. I'm trying to be in there one way or other. Word. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to be up in there. I'm trying to see what's popping. I still got to find my bottles, man. But I'm trying to be up in there. So I'm about to see what happened right now. I'll be back. That was you listening to DKX, the radio, whatever, radio station, and um, you gotta wait till they play Drake songs back to back to back, and then you call in, whatever. I don't know if you got memorized songs or whatever, I'm gonna listen, he told me to download the app and listen to them all day. I'm gonna try to win some tickets, but if I can't win, I'm buying the tickets. He says and buff two buff is an hour away from here. So oh, it's going down. You think we was acting up in Texas? Boy, nah, let me stop. <laughs> but yeah, I gotta get me out and everything. He says in February tickets don't go on sale until Friday. So that's what's up. And talking about that, I need a babysitter for um in a couple days. For about four hours. Mom. So now, I ain't talking about it right now. Should we go on up to the second floor? Sure. Let's go. Please come home. Got things in baloney. Please come home. I got things in baloney. So, yeah, right now. At the stand, it uh, really look like I'm gonna make sure the watch houses. 522. <laughs> they stop letting people in at 7. They close at 10. You know what I'm saying? I got tons of clothes. They busy doing something at my uncle and my grandma. Guess my grandma getting her life together. You know the days. You know what they be. <laughs> so she went out and bought. All type of little adapter prongs for the plugs and stuff. Man. Oh, I just want to tell you, I just got them talking to her. That's why it's so good. Like, in the you know. She called, Miss uh, Dr. Collins. She, she called. And I talked to her, I gave her this doctor's number. She's going to call her. If you and she said, I'm going to call you back when I, after I get this talking to her to find out what kind of surgery type you're going to need to make She already done came. And, well, we're going to fix the gate. She plugging up plugs and stuff and organizing her stuff and that's about it right now. She came back from Home Depot, I guess. Now I gotta try at least help her find her keys or whatever, I guess. I don't know if she found them or not, but I'ma help. You know, you gotta look after your loved one. Yeah. But right now I'm about to go outside. Hit this a couple times. All right. Hit this, smoke this, expire all this. Right now I'm hungry. I eat yet. I still gotta take the stove out the back. So 
That's what I think about the girl the best. I went to Where you went to the bathroom? Now the coffee pot and the microwave. Everything is set up over there on that over there. Yeah, I see it. She, she talking about this wanting me to take the stove off and all she time. Got out, she got a stove out there in the hall the, on the porch. Yeah. She wants you to set that out there by the refrigerator. Ain't nobody thinking no refrigerator yet. I know. But uh, I'm about to try to do it, I guess. I gotta clean up this whole back here. That's a thumb back here. Alright. How about smoke for it anyway? Here, let me let me help you with this thing. Alright. Get out of here. It ain't nothing but bottles in the rope. We just have them on the can. They, they just throw them down. I don't know. I was not trying to carry us all the way over there with no Gucci on. Gotta get me on a good day. We're gonna be talking mega jump for no reason. Man, it should be like, oh, Christian woman. And Christian is this. And I'm like, yeah, okay. Dude, one thing about being Christian, I'm going to tell y'all now. What you got to realize is that the first rule is leaving Jesus Christ and God. The 
second rule is we all sinners. We all got our flaws. It's about working on the flaws and following the rules of God. I'm dancing. All this other stuff that people be putting in, the, you shouldn't do this, and you gotta believe this, and da da da. da. It's not even about that. It's about yourself, personal journey, a self development <laughs> work, your relationship, your relationship with God, and pleasing other people ain't got nothing to do with it. All right, now. It's about you pleasing God. That, it, that's all about it. it. All it is about. We're looking for my brush. <laughs> it's right here. It got all muddy now. But look, put these muscles outside. Now I got to clean that off. I'll be honest, I might have did that. Let's go out in this water. Let's stay in that water for a minute. Well, I gotta wash that off. That's the good day. But, like that, it's not that bad out here. I think it's pretty dark, man. It really is, that's good. Not like, <laughs> but, get this other stuff out of here. You talking about ain't nobody pick it up. They keep locking the gate up. But, after I get done this, I'm going to help her find her stuff. I'll be back. Lock the door. Close the door. Lock the door. Yelling at him. And then <laughs> he locked the door. I guess he locked out across the street. And he's like, why you do that? Why you lock the door? <laughs> you just told me to lock the door. You can't go that. We just said lock the door. Lock the door. Let me pick that stuff up in a minute. I got a lot of bottles. Take that. I got bottles of paper, I got cold one, I got nice food, man. I ain't got time for none of this. Oh, I got that thing, huh? Yeah, man. I see the title and stuff. I know I started out all crazy and stuff like that. But I've been thinking about getting a Hellcat. You know what I'm saying? Is that the move for me to do? Like, I want a newer model car. Or I really want a truck. I was looking at the Durango. And stuff like that. Um, something with some room in it. I really want, like, multiple vehicles anyway. I was thinking about getting a Hellcat. And... I noticed that it's a lot of, like, raffles and stuff going on, too. Like, with CJ on 32s, he be having this raffle. Like, a lot of people be having their raffles and stuff like that. You know, think about entering into the raffle. Uh, I think about going on. Think about this. Go do that yeah, right now. I'll go put some money on a, a raffle and see... If I'm winning or not, maybe I do, maybe I don't. I'm just wondering, like, what's the rules and stuff like that, too. I got to look into it because some of them, they be wanting you to come pick it up yourself or they'll ship it to you or whatever. So I got to see what's going on with that, too, because, I mean, I got to go all the way to Chicago. <laughs> just get my car. Or Dallas, one or two. 
But yeah, man. Comment below if I should do that. Like, what car is hot? What car should I get? What should I do? Let me know, man. Comment below. But I see some heat. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I still want a caddy. I ain't gonna lie about that. I want a Cadillac DeVille still. That's one of my dream cars. A Rolls Royce Cloud. And a Phantom. Rolls Royce Race. I want all three of those. Those are my dream cars. Uh, Ferrari and Lamb. Lamborghini. You know what I'm saying? I will still like teeter with the Porsches and stuff like that. And I want a um, kit car. I want a um. I I want a kit project for real for real. Cause they looking fire. They're just the aesthetics of them look good. Let's see what's going on here. Like my wife knocked out. So I stuck the sheet off the bed. She was just on the phone with me. My kids just running around, chilling. Hey, baby. Like, she was just on the phone with me. Sure. Yeah, sure. What's she doing? You got hold Yeah, baby. Don't miss out on famous great shoes and savings. Jumpfamous.com and local famous footwear near you. Yeah, I'm recording. Oh, All right, hold on. I'll be back, guys. Back in the house. And, like, right now, this feels so much better. But. I got, like, really, like, bust these bags down and stuff and all our stuff down. Now, Desire done did this. She done went in there and just dumped everything. Those are a whole bunch of, like, plastic bags in a bag. That was you and I've been wondering, like, where all the bags are. You know what I'm saying? Come in here, organize this stuff, pick up stuff, put it over here, knock the stuff down again. This one, they um, bonnets, like stuff like that. And I gotta put this stuff away. See, bags like this, bag full of pads, just mad pack of pads and stuff, and ball, all that stuff. Hit this down after I'll get ready to do. First, I gotta go to the store though, I'll get some milk and stuff. I guess no. Get some baby cereal, the baby oatmeal, and stuff up there. So I can thicken it up, cause especially now they're sick, so they don't be really want to eat or nothing. But I can put food and make them smoothies and stuff. <laughs> put in any milk. You mix baby food, like fruits and vegetables and stuff, with the milk. Put a little oatmeal in there. Make a smoothie. Plus, it's healthy for him. You know what I'm saying? It's a snack and it's healthy for him. I'm about to get ready to do that. I wait till she come up out the bathroom, though. You know what I'm saying? So I can use it. I don't wait for her. I gotta think this is. I do walk around like this. I think that's cool. Huh? You think that's cool? Uh, I reckon it. I got to find out what's going on with the Drake tickets, though. I've been listening to radio all day. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, I got to get all my guns and line them up in my office. Got my stuff looking right. Like, I've been trying to get through all of this, and it's like same stuff over and over again. And then, let alone they keep taking my clothes away. So, and truth be told, this is not as bad as it looks. And I know that. So, look at that. My cloud coming down. Storm cloud. Shit. 
I'm gonna take care of all that. They got stuff hanging up. I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna pull up bar. <laughs> when I wash your clothes, it'd be good though. Cause that week it'd be manageable. Just wash clothes normally. Thing is, I've been trying to get through all these damn bags. And some of these bags, like, all old bags of clothes. I'm going to do that. I'm going to wash some clothes tonight. Since she's taking me to the wash house tomorrow. And then I'm going to put them in some bags. Right? So now I just go to the wash house and dry them. That would be the best thing to do. But so that's what I'm about to do, too. All right. All right, I'll be back with you in a minute. Bathroom time. I can't get the bathroom. I can't move. I'm going to use the bathroom.